who's here. Hi. Still, thank God. My lens is dirty, but I don't care. I'm sure you guys don't care that much either. But we just got to Orizaba Park. We're just gonna have a fun sesh and uh, warm up. Yeah, we're waiting for. Hit up a new park in Hawaiian Gardens. Yep. Wait, waiting for Ajax to uh, wake up. So we just decided to meet up earlier and have fun here. All right, guys. Whenever you come to Orizaba, you gotta watch out for these. I've seen people get pitched right into that bank, like super hard. Cause it looks just like a normal leaf. I mean, you just did a nose ground first try. But if you hit that part, you just go flying. It's the worst. Yeah. That was tight though, that was a cool line. Oh, new trick. <laughs> Jeez, man. Almighty Ajax on the sesh. What's up, G? Long time no see. How you doing, dude? How you do? Long time no see. How you been? Good, dude. Uh, yeah, what you got? You're the magic man. You show up and he lands it. Wow. Should we just get out of here now? Hey Jack, where'd you bring us, dude? Ooh, the spot. Right? Oh. Dude. No time. Looks like an awesome <laughs> mini ramp with like obstacles in the middle. It's like perfect. We're the only ones here? How look is it possible? Look at this truck, dude. This truck is like extracurricular activities. Dude, that's how you know it's you're like living right. Golf, skateboarding, volleyball, That's how you know you're basketball. living that best life. Gotta have it. You know? This is a, a fun motor. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, Ajax always knows all the new parks, man. We out here. He's brought me to like at least five new parks I didn't even know about. This one I just found Dude, out Dude, so, so sick. sick. Wow. Come up, Lowe's. Second go! Damn! That was so sick! Oh my dude. god, I got so you gotta lucky see on that one. That was a little squirrely there. I think your arms moved a little too much. <laughs> Good save. Yeah, 
<laughs> First try. As for you, Aaron, Braille. <laughs> you got it. You got it, Ajax. I got you, bro. I'm still filming. That's why I love skating with this guy. Oh, bro, it's I always, always like love skating with Ajax, bro. One, Two in a row. <laughs> Spider-Man over here. So you guys can see that gap. And that's a wrap and we are out of here and Carlos you still suck bro like really bad <laughs> We don't need that I figure we're probably gonna need this little guy Get to work son Oh wow thank god you got that Get to work Got no, come on, Carlos. Give me that. Give me that. I'm not letting him do that to himself. Watch out. I got you. Go ahead. No, I said Go make ahead. him sweep. No, I got him, bro. I got him. Are you going to make me sweep? We're out here, man. Got to put in work. It's street skating. It's not easy. Got to play with what you got. You really think you got this stuff? I mean, looking oh, at this yeah. thing. This needs it. Look, let me hook the homie up, though. He needs this right now. I just need, like, that part. What part? That part. Look how beautiful that sweep job is. Always gotta wax that wheel bite, bro. Yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah. I'm not gonna let you forget about it, bro. I wanna see you be successful. Yeah, good. Don't worry. You got it. Ugh. Actually, the fall wasn't that bad, though. I'm pretty happy on that. <laughs> Yeah! Got it, guys!
Boo yeah. Yeah. That's it. Okay. Yeah. Let's do it. That was proper. I haven't forgot how to street skate, guys. I skate a skate park every single day. I know that. But urban, right here. This is what's real life is. Skateboarding 101. Take it to the streets. Take it to the streets. So little known fact, two, three years ago, we had a battle with this same exact trick and he tried it 150 times. your head for real yeah on, on the curb bro oh shit his ears a little red there's no blood oh. Let's see it uh, jeff rally intro i love that, that is a i want some more intro. let's go all right guys that was like the ultimate slam he just fell slipped back and hit the side of his head on the freaking curb and uh i kind of want him to stop but if he's gonna go for it he's gonna go for it Twenty bucks on this kickflip. So this was a day to where I actually felt way more confident to skateboard, and it just worked out in the end of the day. I just, you know, Nigel's always telling me like, "Hey, I'm not gonna film you unless you stick it." I was like, "No, just pull out the camera, pull out the camera right now." I'm so hungry. I gotta do it right now. And somehow I convinced this guy to actually film me. You're pretty and good at that, though. This is very hard to do this because Jeez. the wood was contradicting my will. So ten bucks. And Next there was go. nails sticking out, and it was very tough. It's having a, a problem because the uh, the wood it's pretty soft wood, I bet. And then there's cracks. So he literally has to land with like one set of wheels right here, one set of wheels right here, so that he could just roll from it. And not to mention, this board right here is like, where it's broken already, it's like, dude, my foot could go like right through it if I wanted to. Damn! Got that five. <laughs> Sorry, I messed it up. I messed it up. It's basically a low tide to where... You, you were going to try a tray flip hippie jump, right? That's what I wanted to do, for sure. Yeah. But it didn't work out, so... Because it was high tide. Yeah. It was it was horrible. Like, that thing was like nine feet tall. You almost went through, bro. And I didn't want to waste Nigel's time. See it on my camera, too. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to all up the bench and try this. So first came the kick flip. Right which, honestly, surprisingly, came very fast. It was very nice. Okay. Yeah, and I was stoked that I got it so quick. But I started trying to double like flip it, and that's where the battle ground. began. Because like there was something. nails sticking out, there were screws, and I kept eating it over and over. But I didn't want to waste Nigel's time, you know. And somehow I got it, and I just laid down. 
I was so stoked that I got it and yeah, worked out. Props, bro. It's like and, skateboarding. Oh. So you never want to plan your trick when you go out and filming because you never know what's going to happen, you know? We plan to do a different trick. I'm not going to talk about it because I still might come back. But ended up just having a better idea. The, the what do you call it? The shore was a lot higher, so it made the gap a lot bigger. So we ended up getting a couple different tricks yeah. that are Come and stand more. over here so, so they can see actually how tall it is, dude. Because this is like seven feet, almost eight feet tall. It's huge. Yeah. So it's basically the reason I don't plan tricks because every time I do, I never really get it. We got a really like a high tide going, so it's it's pretty huge. And uh, unfortunately, I didn't get the trick we wanted, but you know, skateboarding is all about having more ideas and just getting out there and expanding your freaking you know your horizon of what you could do. Yeah, good so job, man. We just had a battle out, and dude, just grateful. I got another the trick. Battle scars. So in this scene. Um, Nigel actually took me my first time at Hooters <laughs> and it doesn't sound as bad okay Hooters is actually a nice place to have really good food so I recommend you guys go out there and uh, enjoy it get the really really hot wings but we skated the spot and I'm doing this gnarly line following my buddy Ajax and I'm doing a coffin grind right here or coffin ride and it was just fun like beyond that point when you get a good trick you just want to goof around you know when you take skating serious you just want to goof around regardless of the results but we got kicked out so we just started you know what okay we're good we're gone let's just bomb the hill do as much tricks as you can and as you can tell i always fall on my easiest trick <laughs> always tray flip no problem but this is after the whole double flip kick flip event off the here, and it was it was it was hard yeah. and this was second try as well no Damn. problem and this unfortunately wasn't using my part and it was hard because I, I I actually ate it right there I actually really hurt myself on that first fall I, I am gonna be honest though this one is kind of my fault I just feel that you know this is a trick maybe I should have filmed with my other camera but since we we're skating around I didn't have it but uh, if you ever wanted to do something here again like maybe a nolly flip I would film with my other camera and it'd look amazing, so. See, Nigel, don't lie to me, man. <laughs> I'd appreciate it if you would, but I don't think I'll ever nollie flip that thing. That thing is hard to skate. It was hard enough just to kickflip. And if you guys don't believe me, take yourself all the way to Long Beach, downtown, and actually step up to that. that was pretty and try to kickflip into it. Try to ollie into it. And I guarantee it's gonna be really hard for you. No problem. Ouch, dude. Are you okay? Yeah. That was almost a freaking. That was oh, the first. Dude, like, I seriously, like, scraped my nipple on the ground, dude. <laughs> that was almost the first man eat a scorpion I've ever seen. I tapped on the last one. Was that it? No. Nope, that it? it wasn't it, Nigel. No. Nigel no. said it was that it. It wasn't it. Uh, this is a trick that I didn't really think people would like, and somehow it just kind of worked 
itself into my part. It actually filmed the few tricks. This was one of these clips that was very hard. And I had it actually, yeah, I rode away with my butt right there. That was nice. <laughs> First try. First try. Like Aaron Cairo and in Braille. Thank you guys for the shout outs all day. This is just something like the ground was so rough. I actually ended up cutting my hand over and over again on this. I cut my hand twice, so both of my hands, left and right, were cut. It was very harsh, and even though I clipped on the landing, it was nice. It was hard. And anybody who hates on the clip, go try it. Have fun with it. It's very hard to do something like that down something like so big. Yeah. Okay, so Carlos, we st we did a bet right away, and he got really, really close to this oh. right away in the beginning. And uh, he actually kind of landed it, but not really. Dude, that's the whole three-second rule, man. And that's not actually, even three to, seconds, bro. I have to abide by it, okay? You were right. I didn't land it, and I ended up eating it 52 tries before I even landed the actual clip. Bro, this is one of the gnarliest battles I've ever seen. This and is I'm the so gnarliest battle for my part, okay? This is, if you guys have to ask any question, this is the gnarliest battle that I've ever had for any clip that I've done for the video part that you just recently seen. Yeah, dude, so it was- on my end, it was horrible. It was also 95 degrees that day. Yes. It was super hot. The beginning of summer. But what's great about this day and nobody knows about is uh, Cricket hit up Nigel and we actually got to skate the street league course that day. So Nigel rounded up a bunch of good homies and we got to skate and I actually got a good trick out of it. And this is the aftermath. So I was kind of tired already. And I ended up falling 52 times before I even landed it. And you can see right there, like my butt hurts. <laughs> it was horrible, it was horrible. Nigel, get better at filming, bro. One day, maybe. I'm trying, you know, tw 22 years in the game, and, uh, you know, I'm kind of figuring it out. Oh, this is before the gimbal. Step by step, day, day by day. day. There you go. <laughs> One day I'll learn how to film. Okay, if you young kids don't know about that, uh, just look up. Just look up those lyrics. Yep, look them up. And Comment. Let us know. So now we're, uh, what? I don't even know. We're like 20 in. Or nah, something. This is like 50 tries in, bro. Okay, so I'm done talking because I know I have another 25 to realize like what my shame is. <laughs> Enjoy the show. Just know that out of every clip I filmed in my part, this was the harsh, this is like the beating I took over everything. My nickname is Fibs, and you work hard at your tricks, and every time when it's hard, just take your hat off, because that was a controversy on this trick. I took my hat off, aerodynamics, dude, I'm good. I landed it. <laughs> aerodynamics. Dynamics. Dude, I said domestics. Okay, okay, restart, restart that. Okay. Nah, bro. Dude, Fly, bro. No, I said Is this spot even still here? Yeah, they just actually reopened channel. Oh, okay. I thought it was done. Yeah, thank God. Oh, that's uh, none of this actually, made the part either. I'm not really much of a training See, skater. Thing, I'm still like, working on it. We know how to fall. Don't you? you know, though, after watching this trick, 
I think we could have used that, you know? I didn't have a say in that one, so it's all good. Yeah. Well, this was so old that I think we both just kind of forgot about it, dude. You well, know? I don't remember half the stuff we filmed. <laughs> we just film it, then it sits on your computer for, you know, whenever we feel like we're done with the project. And this is just one of those things that didn't make the cut. But it's not that bad, you know. It was actually really fun this day. This is another hot day, by the way. Yeah, it was. This is a really, um, I don't skate tranny, but this is one of my favorite tricks to do. Dude, you did like all of them in a row too. You didn't mess up on any of them. Well, it takes a while, you know, just to get used to it. Yeah. And uh, shout outs to Morpheus from The Matrix once again. Teaching you how to do some magic. I don't know. It's either Morpheus or Darth Vader. I shouldn't even say Darth Vader because I've never seen Star Wars before, so. What? I'm lagging on that. Bro. I know, dude. Every, I think I know everything about Star Wars from Family Guy, all the spoofs. <laughs> This thing is really steep, by the way. It's so steep. And this is the one and only time I've ever done this trick. Really? Invert, yeah. Or, you know, tranny or to fakey. That was buck. I think I tried it again, like, a couple weeks later at another skate park, and I just landed, like, nose manny and just got slammed down so hard oh. on my hit. It's so windy out there. This I'm spot is fun. It's always nice and cool. It's never hot up there because it's like close to the beach. Yeah. Oh yeah, this one didn't even make the cut either. Nope. I think it did it really fast too. You did, bro. That was first go. Oh yeah. It was literally first try. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> no, then you want to start doing other stuff. Since when does Carlos Slaster ever want to just try one trick? When it's like a 20 stair? When it's the cliff? When it's the cliff. <laughs> Three is not bad. Which you guys don't already know, we're already working on a new project, so already stacking. Never stop going. Oh yeah. See, I don't even remember doing this. Yeah. This is that long ago. I think I'm the only guy to skate it that way. Yep. And that's the crack I was talking about. That thing is horrible, dude. I can clip that. I know we can. Keep yeah, and then these road. guys came and killed it. Come this way. I have no idea what I just said right there. You did that first go too. I'm gonna shut out that Bruce Lee kick out. That's weird that I don't remember any of this stuff. Yeah, right? This is like when we first started filming the part, so. It was. Literally, like the week after your other part came out. <laughs> was this before or after Woodward? Uh, I think it was before. Oh, that's what came out. Okay. This is one of those tricks I try to tell Nigel about, and he's just like, nope. <laughs> it's like, I'm not even going to film it unless you stick one. I didn't even think it was possible. He told me, and I was like, yeah, what? It's so weird that we never have problems with people at that spot, and this was the day, like, everyone was just whack. People are so dumb, I swear. That guy looked like McDonald's, man. He's loving it. Yep. And as it goes, you know, especially if you're, like, a sponsored skater or you're really uh, particular, you've got to land it perfect. Have to. Or somewhat good. Have to. And that one really hurt. Yeah, because you almost landed on your back, back to Primo. That right there was getting So it just happened. Yeah. And I don't really have a problem with kids, right? It's just, you know, when you're in the process trying to get a trick done, it's just... Yeah. You're trying to take... You're trying to handle business. And you can't say anything to them, you know? Trying to handle business. Can't say anything. Can't talk crap or any of that stuff, so... That's where being a professional really comes in. Yeah, I've seen people like uh, yell at kids and it's like, dude, that was hey, dude like with no remorse. They don't even feel yeah. bad about it. Dude, Carlos, what are you doing, bro? We got day. ten more tricks to film. And I don't even know why I'm laying oh, down right there. <laughs> man, you know if you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. It really does help. Also, please subscribe to my channel if you like the type of content that I, that I post. I upload almost every day. And please turn on those post notifications so that you're notified when I post a video. Thanks, yo. Have a great day.
or night or whatever. 